<laughs> it's me, the Tumblr man. Let's do this. Do you think the royal family kids watch Coco Melon, or can they watch only court jesters or something? We're off to a good start. The most important canon facts Tales Tube has given us. Tales uses Tumblr. In his world, Tumblr has a two-tailed icon. The fact above might imply Tales has created Tumblr. Thank you, Tails. 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 <sighs> Thank you, Tails. Hey, Sundial, what are your pronouns? NVIDIA GeForce RTX 2060 Intel Core i5 10400 FCPU 16 gigabyte RAM. Oh, wow. Cool. Thoughts on women and Dice City? I've gotten better at dodging their acid attacks. <laughs> Have you? I guess we'll see. <laughs> I don't know, dude. I was walking through the valley of the green glass doors, and my butt was there, and yours wasn't. Interesting. Writing prompt. Your supervillain nemesis is a little more than a goofy comic relief. Always coming up with clunky machines and insane nonsensical schemes. When a new dangerous villain appeared, your nemesis utterly destroyed them, and then continued on like nothing happened. I'm sorry, did you mean critically acclaimed DreamWorks movie motherfucking Megamind? And you put up the blue dude! Look at that blue dude! Andy, I swear to God, if you put up the wrong blue dude, I... But some people respond to any well-foreshadowed reveal with, Ugh, that plot twist is so predictable. Proves bad faith criticism has rotted their brains to the point where they think it's bad writing if they can correctly identify information the writers were intentionally giving them. <sighs> One of the characters in our D&D party is an orc named Brick. We established that orcs got their names through test of strength, and that his name is Brick because it's the strongest thing he was able to break with his bare hands. By profession, Brick is a therapist. His ultimate ambition is to one day do therapy so good that he can change his name to depression. I went into expecting beautiful himbo and came out in love with Brick and crying over therapist orcs. This is the most beautiful thing I've ever heard. Mouse Girl Conspiracy Theorist handing you a folder of documents. And remember, this is just the tip of the iceberg. They all have top squeak rat stamped on them. Very strong addition! Trans guy who finally figured out his name about to come out in the funniest way to his friends. Hey guys, can I be frank with you all? <laughs> That's good, I like that. It's spooky month, so I'm once again removing all protection around my house from spooky creatures. Gonna have one hell of a spooky party! <laughs> Don't let the creature in. Don't. Just don't. All right, you listen to me. Listen. Your actual job in life, and it sucks that your fifth grade teacher didn't explain this adequately enough, is to ask for help when you need it, and to accept charity when it would take weight from your shoulders. Otherwise, you end up like Sisyphus, or even worse, Walter White. You don't want to be Walter White. Hey, is Adosha compliant to Uwu on the job? Absolutely not! Imagine the danger you're putting yourself in! Is Obo okay? Yes! Keep your eyes open! I hate that this is the punchline. Thanks, Osha. In a horse accent. Nope! This is the horse equivalent of being lost in the sauce. What the fuck is a horse accent? Stands in the hallway of your blog saying nothing like a sibling. Going game playful? I'm non-binary, which means that the gender goblin came up to me in the middle of the night a few years ago and stole my gender. And I have been no beanie ever since. But I think... I think the gender goblin tried to return it, but they... They gave me the wrong one. Throws ibuprofen on the ground and watches the aging tumbler populace peck at them like chickens. Hey, don't be ridiculous. Our backs and knees absolutely cannot do that. Yeah, if you could just hold them out in the palm of your hand like you're feeding a horse, that'd be great. A character trope I like is a person who is a nice, good person and acts well-adjusted. Then they do something where it's like, Oh, you're uh, secretly a little bit insane, actually. Mmm, a small black coffee with a blueberry shot. Bugs Bunny injects estrogen and testosterone at the same time and strikes himself up and down like a cocktail. I love it. Hey, why do old people read the Bible so much? I asked the old guy standing in front of me at the post office, and he said, It's because we're cramming for finals. Ha! <laughs> uh, that's good. <laughs> Maybe becoming a werewolf wouldn't fix my mental illness, but it would fix my not being a werewolf problem. Do you ever think about that? It's not comfort media, it's things that plague me at night. Hey guys, I'm eating a gummy worm. Do not try to eat the other end while I'm distracted again. Start to eat the other end just to piss you off. Let go! <laughs>